Hello and welcome once again to Morgate Andrology. Now in today's video we're going to talk about hypospadias and in particular the effect of hypospadias on the length of the penis. Studies have shown that the length of the penis can be abnormally affected by hypospadias and studies have shown that in the development stage, the stretched length of the penis in patients with hyperspadius can be shorter than the expected average. Now, where this is the case, of course, this can cause significant anxiety as, uh, as people grow you know, into adolescence and so on, and they become particular uh, about their penile size. Um, it can cause severe anxiety issues, so it's something to watch out for. The other factor in the penile size in relation to hyperspadius is surgery that might be performed to correct curvature. Um, quite often, plication procedures are performed to correct a curve, but these surgeries are on the longer side of the penis. And where plication procedures are performed on the longer side of the penis uh, to make the penis straight again, the penis effectively becomes the length of the shorter side here. So this results in penile shortening. So there is a, a risk anyway in hyperspadius of having a shorter penis and procedures, surgical procedures that are used to correct curvature in hyperspadius can also result in penile shortening. If you have concerns about your penis size because of hyperspadius, maybe you had surgery as a child or your hyperspadius um, uh, developed complications following surgery as a child. If you have any problems as an adult, please do get in touch with us here at Morgate Andrology. We can arrange a consultation for you with one of our urologists to discuss all aspects to discuss all aspects of hyperspadius